Hi, my name is Mark Hayward. Uh, this is a short shift uh, podcast. I want to talk to you today about progression in your job. You might be slightly different. You might be uh, you might be someone that's got a job, got a career. You're progressing, but uh, you've kind of got shunted. You're kind of maybe a little bit stagnating. You're not quite kicking on as you'd like to. Um, and so what my thoughts are here is the sort of pros and cons of learning on the job versus doing a course. So one point is before you're married, before you've got kids, it's a hell of a lot easier to do a course in the evening. Fact. I've got two kids. I've got a wife. I can't go and do three hours in the evening because I'm needed at home. That doesn't mean that you can't do it. It just makes it harder. There's negotiations that you have to have within family and setting, etc. So, so you could say if you're in that position, you want to learn on the job. So the advantage on learning on the job is... You are specifically doing something that will aid your career. So if you're learning, I don't know, a visualization tool, a tableau or a click view, to be able to share with your clients something that adds value to them. You can learn to do that by getting knowledge from other people. Learning takes a little bit longer. You might be able to stretch it over two or three sessions but you then gain the knowledge. It's slower, but you've probably got a good basis for your job by doing it on the job, if that makes sense. So I'm going to counter that with doing a course. So there are a number of courses that can be done on a number of different subjects. You can do short courses like six, 12, 18 weeks worth of courses on marketing, sales, business analyst, whatever it is. Now, the difference between doing a course and doing training on the job is a course will give you a wider knowledge and give you skills that you don't have, which might mean you could move to another job. Now that might be internally, it might be externally. So a course is more of a catalyst. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. A course is something that should catapult your career forward. In a lot of cases, that would probably mean leaving your job and using those skills that you've learnt um, more in that uh, in that new job. Now, the, the the kind of the sort of good and bad is the course gives you the knowledge; it doesn't give you the experience. So you can go into an interview and you can say, "I know everything about digital marketing." Great. So, what's your experience of? marketing in a digital environment well i haven't really done anything with that at the moment but i've got all the knowledge now some companies go okay he's got the skills we'll give him a punt some companies will go too dangerous too risky i'm not going to give him that job because he's got no practical experience so this is the difference between learning on the job and gives you practical experience for your career at that current job a course gives you a wider breadth of knowledge but doesn't give you practical skills so it's difficult to be able to prove in a career job uh, new job of what is the best course of action I, I do think some of this point is really down to your time available that you've got. So if you've just come out of university living at home or living with friends, you've got a lot of time to be able to do a, do courses to be able to develop your skills. <coughs> Excuse me. 
So I think it's important at this point that you've got both experiences, you've got both things. What is best for you? That's what you need to understand. Now, doing something on the job is probably slower, less breadth of knowledge, but very specific to the job and can give you a promotion. Doing a course, wider breadth of knowledge, lots of practical uh, knowledge, but no experience, which might not give you a promotion to your job, but might give you another job that's equal or even better than what you've got. So I would say, I'm not going to give you one or the other because I think both are relevant and both are important to consider. I think they both have advantages and depending on your mindset, on your career aspirations, on your family experiences and what's currently going on with you, you need to be able to judge whether those things are a formal course or whether uh, learning on the job is better. OK, uh, Twitter, Mark Hayward 169 uh, YouTube, you'll see all the videos. Facebook, I've got a private group called Absolute po uh, Business Mindset. And that's also what my podcast is called. So check it out.